Hello, mister. Would you like a leaf? Look, oh, did you see that tongue? Holy crap. People always told me I need someone like you. Someone who gets me and someone who's cool, yeah. And I like the way you are. And no one at all. All right, guys. Today we are in Panama City Beach. Where are we going, babe? Zoo World. Zoo world. <laughs> According to the sign up here, we have giraffes and tigers and lemas and God only knows what else. We actually passed this place when we pulled in. The RV park that we're staying is right down this road and around the corner. Are you ready to zoo world? It was $100 total to come in, 25 bucks a person. And then we bought one experience, they called it, where Lady Love is gonna get to snuggle with a capybara. So, <laughs> that will be pretty interesting. I'm not sure if we're trying to see something in these places here right now, but apparently this uh, snuggling thing starts at 12.30, so we're gonna go down here and see if we can find that. Look at this, we have bunnies. Oh, okay, it says do not pick up, so make sure you don't pick them up, love. Look at the little bunnies. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then 14, 15, 16, even more over there. Holy crap, look at these little guys. What in the world are they doing behind us? Yeah, they're like cutting down a tree or something over here, so that's what that loud sound is. But anyways, here are the bunnies. <laughs> look at the lop ears on this guy here. He is a hungry fella. So we almost walked by this place right here, and then I noticed this kookaburra up here. <laughs> Actually, I have no clue what a kookaburra is, but he sure looks like he would be a kookaburra. Well, look who's waiting for us here. Hello, sir. Look at this guy. He's just like out in the middle of nowhere. Man, he ate that stuff up like it was M&M's. Hello, little goat friend. Hello. So there is all kinds of stuff out here, guys, that we're gonna have to come back around here to show you, but we saw monkeys and kangaroos and capybaras and birds and everything. And then this, what in the world is happening here? <laughs> Excuse me, sir, that's my lady. Excuse me. <laughs> so it's kind of hard to see these guys in here, but these are sloths hanging from the trees in here. And I believe we're in the right place where Marion's supposed to snuggle this little guy, a rodent of unusual size. There she goes. I think she's heading in to see this little guy right here. Llamas and capybaras. This is so funny, look at that little guy. He has a, a short little snout too. So it's near impossible to see right now because of, well, because of this piece of wood here and uh, because of the shadows, but there's Marion in there petting that little capybara. That is so hilarious. It's almost like a bit, a mix between a bunny and a giant rodent. <laughs> Will she pick him up? That is the question. Pick up the capybara. Snuggle the capybara. <laughs> Wait a minute, what in the heck? In a strange turn of events, she ended up with a baby kangaroo around her neck. What in the world? A little roo in a bag. <laughs> yeah, that's about the best shot I can get of that. Marion holding a baby roo, and then the rodent of unusual size over here nibbling on something. What is this guy nibbling on? He's nibbling on a grass. Well, that was definitely interesting. So meanwhile, the loud tree cutter guy moved from over here. So we're gonna get to go over there now and see the birds and whatever else is through this area. Okay, so tell us about the capybaras, babe. Okay. The capybaras are very social animals and they are mostly in South America, but their cousin is the Nutrarat, which is in Louisiana. And I met a couple of those Heck and no. they're in the park. And um, so he's very, very um, well, coarse hair. Very coarse hair, and that was Trey that just walked by. He was my um, guy that helped me in there with the capybara. And if I sat on the ground, he would come right up and 
capybara, not for the tray, <laughs> would come right up and uh, get on my lap. But I was afraid to get down there and wouldn't be able to get up again. So I didn't want to embarrass myself. So I sat on the bench. And he was nibbling on everything. And he does have some teeth, but they're not really sharp. And he was nibbling on my um, shoelaces. And um, he was just, and, and if he fluffs out, that means he's very comfortable with you and that you're, it's, it's good to go. So how did you end up with a roo then? Okay, so the kangaroo's a baby kangaroo named Sandy, and the uh, capybara's name is Guppy. And um, so the kangaroo is a four-month-old baby girl kangaroo, and I found out some interesting facts about them too. They have kangaroo women, or <laughs> kangaroo, female kangaroos have <laughs> two, two vaginas and two uteruses, so they can be pregnant at the same time in both of them. And they can also put their pregnancy on hold, not abortion or not getting rid of it, just on hold. Well, because ba kangaroos are heavy, those baby kangaroos, and they're the size of a jelly bean when they're born. Mm. And they make their way from the vagina up into the little pouch, and that that's where they stay to finish out their, uh, their growth. Interesting. There's even ladybug friends here at the zoo. Okay, so here's all our signs for where things are. And it's kind of strange in here today because they're doing that tree cutting stuff. So they have this stuff out. Plus there's not many people in here. So it's just kind of confusing. It's like a maze, but we're gonna try to figure out where there's giraffes here. Yeah, we're gonna go back to the giraffes in just a minute. That's what this is for, even though a goat ate half of it already. Okay, the budgie bushwalk aviary. This is where all the birds are, apparently. A minute ago, we saw these all like flying around like crazy in here. Apparently, they will land on you. Look at these things. All these pretty little bird friends. Hello, bird friends. Hello. I gotta get up here to this tree. Hello, bird friends. <laughs> You could get these things called budgie sticks, which is what these guys have, and the birds will land on you and eat off of the stick. But I don't know where you get them. Apparently up front, but they never offered us anything like that. I wish they'd all go swarming around the whole place again like they were a minute ago. That was crazy. Like some Alfred Hitchcock stuff. Look at this, they're all swarming around our shoes here, trying to eat our feet. What in the world? <laughs> too funny. Excuse me, sir, can you not butt me? <laughs> He's jamming his horns into my leg because he wants food. Yeah, check this out, guys. There's so many goats around here. Hello, goat friends. Like, this is the whole place where the goats are, well, fenced off, I guess. Hello, mister. But then there's some that are just random walking around the park. Oh, he just almost got butted. <laughs> I see you, sir. I know you want a bite of food, but I have to save some for everyone else. You can't just hog it all. Yeah, look at all these goats. Hello. Look at the ears on you. I like your ears, sir. Excuse me. I know, I know, you want a bite too. Look at all, oh! <laughs> this guy got me again. Could you please not, sir? Excuse me. Look, this is what he wants. He sees this, because he, want, he wants what's in it. Because it's a little feed. Go after someone else, like, no! <laughs> Excuse me, this guy's jamming these things in my leg and it hurts. <laughs> all right, we're gonna take one of these and use it as a decoy. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> okay, there we go. It worked. <laughs> For a minute. Oh, look at this. Okay, look at this guy here. Hello, Mr. Horns. Look, they all just want food. Obviously. Look at the tiny little ones over there. Okay, let's go see what is over here. <laughs> look at this. Look at this. Okay, first let's look at these guys. Ostriches. What the heck? Hello, sir. What? Excuse me. Oh. He is crazy. Hello. Look at this. That 
Are you hungry? Do we feed you with these pellets? Look at these things. They're enormous. I do not want to get chased by one of these. Look at that one looking right at you, babe. <laughs> Hello, mister. Or missus. Oh, look at what we have right here. It's a deer. Hello, Mr. Deer. I guess it would be Mrs. Deer. I just naturally call everything Mr. He wants a, a pellet. Wait, I'll give him a pellet. Here you go, Mr. Pellet Wanter. Ugh, there you go. <laughs> One more pellet for you because you're funny. Here you go. Here you go. There you go. Look, we got a cow back here. More goats. But look over here. Look at this guy. Llama. Hello, Mr. Llama. If you spit on me, I'm going to be so angry. I'm going to be so very angry. I like you. You look fluffy. But I don't want to get spit. Whoa, that was a mouth. Can I call you Cusco? Wow, I wish I had some eyelashes like that one. <laughs> Wow. Llamas and capybaras. And goats, oh my. <laughs> Look at this. We got mini horses here. Hello, Mr. and Mrs. Mini Horse. Soft nose. Do you have a soft nose? Yes, you do. And look at this little tiny guy. Hello, little tiny goat. Hello. You're my friend. Hello, Bambi. Oh, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> he looks just like Donkey on Shrek. He is Donkey right there. I know. I know, yeah, but this guy, look, look at with his big eyes. Yeah. Hello, Mr. and Mrs. Big Eyes. Look at the eyelids. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> look at that. He's got blue eyes and he has like brown. Hello, soft nose. Hello. <laughs> I know, you have a soft nose too. Look at that blue eye. I don't know why I like those blue eyes so much. These are don't like get, velvet. Don't get bit by those giant teeth. Yeah. Those choppers. All right, guys, we are entering the giraffe paddock. Look at this guy over here. Holy crap. Let's get closer. Hold on. Uh, hello. Holy crap. Look at this guy. Whoa. <laughs> Did he take that entire piece of lettuce? That's hilarious. Hello, mister. Would you like a leaf? Look, oh, did you see that tongue? Holy crap. <laughs> it's like a living dinosaur. Hello, mister. Hello, friends. And look at this. I think these are all guinea pigs in here. What the heck? Hello, pigs. Hello, pigs. Look, they have little fun pig tunnels to run through. Look at this. When new people walk up, he knows there's lettuce coming, so he starts swaying back and forth like he's dancing. Dancing for the lettuce. That is too funny. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's get back through these guys here trying to attack us. And see what we got over here. Look at this, we got duck friends over here. What in the heck is that one over there? <laughs> yeah, there's all kinds of stuff. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Look, there's macaws. If you can see them there, we have a bad reflection here from the sun, so I can barely see them. But off in the distance are more um, uh, capybaras, and then there are macaws over here. There's a couple of there that look like they've been rode hard and put away wet. And <laughs> these ones up here, they're a little better looking. I don't know what this is over here. Some kind of... Oh, it's chickens. Look at this. We have chickens over here, babe. I think it's kind of hard for the camera to see through stuff like this. But yeah, there's a couple of chickens in there. So yeah, you can see these birds over here a little bit better from this side. And then the capybaras over there. And look at this over here. Monkeys. What in the world? We got two big monkeys here. There are at least two. Yeah, look at this over here. We got a peacock. <laughs> Looks like he's wearing a crown. And look, there's another peacock over here. Past this goat here. He's kind of camouflaged in there. 
if you can see him. But I don't know what happened to the... Oh, there's the other monkey right there. Protruding. Reminds me of Ace Ventura. <laughs> and here's one over here in this little... I don't know, like a hammock thing. There they go. Look, he's climbing. They're actually arms called Siamangs. What are you saying, love? The arms are twice the length of their torso. Yeah, yeah you can so. tell, too, when they stretch out to swing and stuff. Look at that guy. He walks... What the heck? Look! <laughs> <laughs> he makes that look so much fun. I know. Monkey. Look. A monkey. He probably has a name. I, w I wish they would put their names out here on the plaque. There he goes. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's like, what does this chick want? <laughs> Look, they're conspiring <laughs> against us now. <laughs> And then over there, there's ring-tailed lemurs in that section. And I see like some turtles and stuff over there too. Okay, yeah, so here's lemurs. Here comes one walking over here. You got, look at that tail, ring-tailed lemur he is. And over here before he goes in is Mr. Turtle. Now look at this. These two over here are fighting. What the heck? <laughs> that is too funny. Oh, he's sneaking up. I thought he was going to sneak up and attack him or something. All right. Wait a minute. What in the world? A screaming, hairy armadillo. I guess he's supposed to be in here. But I don't see him unless he's like snugged up against this edge here. Yeah, look at this. There's more monkeys over here. There's supposed to be an armadillo in there, babe, but I don't see him. Okay. What a strange sound that they have going on in here. Hold on, let's go over here and get a better shot. Squirrel monkeys. And look at this. There's a whole bunch of them in there. If you can see them, and they got this weird music going on. Like this weird African-sounding music. Yeah, look at this little guy peeking out from up here. He's climbing the fence and peeking at us. If we just stay in one place and watch, you can see him like climbing the ropes in here. Like, look at this guy up here. <laughs> and there's this one down here playing with his tail. He just looked like he was trying to tie his tail around one of the ropes. Okay, so we're going into the snakeatorium here. Holy crap. All right, I don't know if I want to see snakes. Mm, oh, what is that? Bearded, Bearded dragon. Oh. Ooh, see if you can see the snake. Green tree, whoa. <laughs> Green tree python, look at that. I don't want him wrapped around my face. What is it called? Euromastic. Right? Euromastic. Euromastic. Euro Euro sticks. something Euro like that. Something. Look at that guy. Oh, he reminds me of the uh, yellow spotted lizards on the movie Holes. Whoa! Look at that enormous one up there. Dang, look at the tail on him, too. He's saying, hi, everybody. Hi, married uh, subscribers. <laughs> yeah, look at this one. Jungle carpet python. And there he is. Heck no, he, he doesn't even look real. It's just beautiful, though, isn't it? I mean, yeah. And then there's this little guy. Hello, friend. Are you getting neglected in here? I like your tail. Look at that big puffy tail. What in the heck? And we have Mr. Giant Turtle here. Look at that guy. What's this thing? Dang. Look at this one. I think this is an iguana. Look at that guy. Dang. Hello. Look at him. He wants something. Oh, he here's another one down here. Hello. I don't have anything for you, but you sure are cool looking. We're deciding Ooh. what these are. Red tail boa. Yeah. Whoa. Look at this thing. Good Lord. Look how huge he is. Look at his face. Oh, oh my gosh. That looks that reminds me of the snake on the Disney Robin Hood cartoon. <laughs> 
Ka, I think his name was. Oh, look, we get our first look at gators here. We hatched on August 26, 21 and 28. Look at this. Here they are over here, tiny little gators. Wow. Oh my goodness. Look at those things. Dang. Yeah, I think through, what the heck? This is made up to look like a cave or something. But through here is kangaroos. They're just mm -hmm. basking in the sun. Mm -hmm. There was something else out here earlier too, wasn't there? I thought we saw something else here, but I don't know. kangaroos. Look at the spikes on the bearded dragon here. Pretty cool. Here's one we almost missed and it's not even labeled. I don't know if you can even see it through the reflection. Look at that giant thing over there. It looks like a boa. Dang. Enormous. Look at this, guys. We circled back around to this bird that I said it looks like a kookaburra, and I was just totally guessing, and now I see this. It is a kookaburra. <laughs> okay, so I think around this way is where we can see some alligators and tigers, if I'm not mistaken. So this is like a whole other side of the park here. Look at this, they got old airplane parts and stuff as if they crashed in the jungle. <gasps> There's lions. This guy doesn't look too happy over here. Look at the mane on the lion. I wish he wasn't sitting where he is so we could see him better, but. All right, let's see if we can get a better picture here. Yeah, look at that guy. King of the jungle. Dang. <laughs> Look at that face on him. Oh, that's the money shot right there. <laughs> Here he comes, he's getting up. Jeez almighty, look at that guy. Oh, dang, look at that guy. Look how huge he is. Look at that face. It's like the MGM lion. As if this music is tricking them that they're really in the jungle or something. <laughs> so we got more monkeys over here. And then over here we have Australian emus. Look at these guys. Holy crap, they're scary. Hello, friend. These guys are huge. Hello, friend. Hello. I don't know if you'd be a friend if I let you peck my hand. <laughs> There, see, yeah, he took it. Cool. All right, I'll try it. Put it in my hand. Ooh, okay. oh. I didn't say three. Now he's going to go nuts on me. <laughs> no, not at all. Try it. Here, oh, he pecked straight down. Just put it out. Don't be. Here go, watch this. Oh, here you go, sir. We got it. Thank you. See? That wasn't too bad, huh? <laughs> yeah, there's a lot more back here than I expected. Oh, here's where we get to go over and see the alligators. Okay. Alapata, Alapata Swamp or something like that. Yeah, look at this, guys. Holy crap. You can see their backs over there just floating in the water waiting for a meal. There's a couple of them over here too. Oh, that's just a stick. <laughs> but over here you can see them just floating, like barely sticking up out of the water. Yeah, look at this. There's a whole bunch of big ones over here on land, on dry land. Look at those things. Oh my gosh, look at those snappers. Then look at this over here in the water in that corner. Look at them all over there. Oh my gosh, crazy. I counted 31 gators just on this side here. Just imagine if you fell in there, you would be lunch. <laughs> yeah, look at this, this guy over here, he's like just waiting for me to fall in so he can feast. Okay, I am not sure what we're gonna see over here, but look at this, this is called Grand Pappy Jollies. What, it's a bear! Holy crap, babe, you were right, it is a bear! Look, here he comes! Here he comes, 
Hello, Mr. Oh, no, he can't come through there. <laughs> I was afraid for a minute. I thought he was about to come right up on us. Look at that guy. I see you. You can't get out there, bear friend. <laughs> I know, he's angry. Bear friend. Bear friend. I don't know if he is a bear friend. He's a bear, but I don't know that he's necessarily a friend. He wants out of there so bad. Yeah, maybe he's hungry. Like, maybe this is where people feed him or something. Because, look, this is actually a hatchet throwing range right here. People throw the hatchets at that 2020 sign. Here he comes. Look at that big guy. Dang. See if he comes back around. Look, we were trying to figure out what these guys are over here. They're warthogs. Hakuna Matata. Oh, here he comes. Look at that guy. Oh my gosh. Hello, mister. I wish I had something for you. No, well, anyways. Hakuna Matata. <laughs> Look at the hair on him. Hmm. Wow. What is this? A red knobbed hornbill. Look at this. Well, <laughs> he looks like his, um, he just barked like a dog. <laughs> what the heck? That is too funny. He looked like, his, he looks like his whole bill is like colored with crayons. Oh. Dookie dookie. Look how he hops. <laughs> oh my gosh. And look at this guy down here with the fro. He's got an afro. What the heck? Bye, Mr. Dogbird. Whoa, what the heck is this kind of bird? Why didn't the... It's gotta be a vulture. Can I see your face? Oh my gosh, look at that thing. That is a vulture right there. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> look at the thing oh my gosh yeah look at this he's a king vulture a sarcophagus papa <laughs> sarcorampus papa listen to the sound this one makes it sounded like Jurassic Park down here listen to that We got another big vulture right up here. I know. Look at that thing. Jeez. Reminds me of Snoopy from the Peanuts acting like a vulture. And then over here we have another tiger. I got. Oh, look at this guy. Mike Tyson's tigers. Bengal tiger. Yeah, look at this guy. He's just completely ignoring us. Look at this, we both just walked up here and thought this snake was real. It's a fake snake and a fake turtle. Here's a closer look at all these gators over here in the water. Look at all those things. There's at least 40 gators in here, if not more. Look at this guy just floating along. Oh, his eyes are open. Yeah. It's so funny how they just stick a little bit of themselves out of the water. There's like two over here, you can just see their little heads. Not little, but their heads. And then over here, there's this one. And it looks like this one's laying on top of the other one. Look at this, guys. On the other side here, we have pink flamingos. What the heck? Look at them. Are they pink? Yeah, they're pink. I'll tell you what, there's no lack for animals in here. I mean, you might walk up to a couple of these places. Did you just snort at me, sir? He did. What? <laughs> you might walk up to some of these and go, where are the animals? But then when they show up, there's a ton of them. There's a whole bunch of these over there. Look at this. And there's a whole bunch inside there, too. And look at this over here. We have enormous turtles. Well, they're not enormous, but they sure are huge. That's about the size of three basketballs right there. Look at that guy. He looks so dry and thirsty. Sir, excuse me, there's some water right there. Go ahead in, take a dip. 
All right, he turned his back to me because we don't have any food. Let's go over here and see this other one because there's a bigger one over here. Look at this ginormous guy over here. He's got the food. But then I noticed there's even bigger ones in here. They're huge. Like this one back here that you can just barely see, he's enormous. Look, this guy looks like he just woke up from a nap and then realized he was surrounded by delicious food. He's like, heck yes. <laughs> All right, we just looked over here and we saw, yep, look at this, porcupines. What the heck? Are they trying to mate? I wouldn't want to be getting up in there. What the heck? <laughs> We're a little bit closer to the lion over here. Ooh, here comes this one too. And I was thinking earlier that it was a lion and tigers, but these are all lions. They're just males and females. Look at the size of that thing. Look at this. We got another tookie tookie. Tookie tookie. Oh, gross. He just pooped. Tookie tookie. <laughs> All right. I think, if I'm not mistaken, this is the capuchin monkeys, like on uh, Night at the Museum. Yeah, right there. White throated capuchin. Hello, capuchin monkeys. Look at that crazy guy. All right. Bye, Mr. Capuchin. And Mr. Co Mrs. Mr. and Mrs. Capuchin. <laughs> All right, we got a new Guinea singing dog. Sing us a tune. I don't quite understand why there's like no water in a lot of these little places for the animals, but there's signs up that say um, something like, where's their water? The water's on demand. So maybe when they go inside, they get water to drink. I don't know. Okay, I think that we've seen just about everything there is to see here. This was a pretty cool place. It was. It was definitely worth the money. But we are ready to roll. So we will see you guys later. People always told me I need someone like you. Someone who gets me and someone who's cool, yeah.